anyone else in Year Street 1. Winston Smith seems to understand that he might be happier if he were free. He watches others and tries to blend in, tries to conceal his unpardonable desire for freedom. However, he has committed deadly thought crime. Being a peculiar individual in this totalitarian state, he can't resist the urge to rebel. In writing in the diary, he becomes a thought criminal and considers himself doomed from the very start. After all, 1984 isn't about Winston's rebellion or tragic love. The character of Winston serves to represent the effect of the party's total control over a human being. The objects and people around Winston symbolizes different conflicts. Big Brother is the party in its public manifestation, or reassurance to most people. But to Winston, he is more of a threat as there is no way to escape from his overwhelming gaze. The omnipresent telescreens are the most direct symbol of the party's constant monitoring of its subject. Through propaganda and bombardment of political information, the party deprives people of their ability to think. It symbolizes how totalitarian government abuses technology for its own end, instead of exploiting its knowledge to improve civilization. The glass paperweight, an artifact that Winston bought in the Pearl District, symbolizes the past that can't be altered by any force. In buying the paperweight, Winston attempts to reconnect with the past. However, this magical thing that seems to possess the power of preserving the past is eventually destroyed by the thought police. All in all, Orwell portrays the perfect totalitarian society, the most extreme realization imaginable of a modern-day government with absolute power, to warn readers in the West of the dangers of totalitarianism.